I dare you, for a second take in the unbearable heartbreak that has been ripping apart pieces of my heart 99 years at a time. I know for some it's hard to imagine, but please attempt to understand. On this very day, 99 years ago, they killed me for reasons that did not exist for pleasure. I could not resist for profit. No, I insist. I was on the devil's waiting list as I watched my dad take a bullet to his head, my little brother who was left behind to starve to death, my pregnant mother who was beat and raped, and I auctioned off to a perverted old man who took me home and converted me to Islam, but of course, I wouldn't give in, so he grabbed the knife and I was no longer alive, and along with me, a million and a half killed for reasons that did not exist, for pleasure we could not resist, for profit, no, I insist, we were on the devil's waiting list as the devil himself awoke through the eyes of those who did this to us, who watched us starve, get burnt, tortured, yet their reaction was no less than a smile. They tried to destroy my race, but it didn't go as planned, so they went into denial, and it's been like that for a while. 99 years. And to this day, the terror exists from assassinating Haran Ding to celebrating an axe murderer for killing an Armenian in his sleep. 2014, and an Armenian populated village of Kassab was target of attacks from Turkey backed Al Qaeda affiliated armed bands, displacing 670 Armenian families while destroying our churches. Tell me this is not. The cycle of the past repeating itself. Tell me they are not deliberately stabbing on our wounds that are as deep as 99 years. Tell me that the past is the past and we should just move on as they continue to torment and humiliate our race, calling us liars, cowards, infidels. This is not war, nor is it fiction. There is nobody to hear my people's affliction, nor the people who did this to us get a conviction. In fact, till this day, Turkey spends millions of bucks trying to cover up their tracks, but we remember, we have never forgot, nor shall we ever. Their stories are the evidence we got, and we will share them. Our wounds remain open till the day they recognize over 1.5 million Armenians brutally massacred. So I dare you for a second take in the unbearable heartbreak that has been ripping apart pieces of our hearts 99 years at a time. Thank you.